You see them? Those are prospects. They haven't earned their top rocker yet. There's only one way to get it. Commit a felony in view of another gang member. Which means what? <laughs> Somebody's gonna fight us when we get out of this car. Exactly. Shouldn't we call for backup then? Where's the fun in that? Can I talk to you? I'm worried about Tim. Why? I think he's spinning out trying to prove himself. You think he came back too soon? He got hit with a lot of personal stuff on top of it, too. And he's not handling it well. Clearly, you have to do something. Yeah, but what? Tim is my T.O. I'm not going to narc on him. And you're going to have to talk to him. Oh. It's not going to go well. What other choice do you have? We don't need to call anybody else. There's a half a million dollars worth of mushrooms in here. We split it. If you're telling you never saw me. OK. What? But I want 60%. So call Detective Murphy and ask her if that's okay with internal affairs. Wait, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? Calling your bluff. Ah! Ah! Seven out of 19, we need an R8 117 Iyers. Everything okay? Yes, ma'am. Um, we had a reversal, but Officer Bradford saw right through it. So. I heard. I wanted to say I really appreciated what you said earlier today about cops doing the right thing every day. Is that because you're seeing evidence of officers acting otherwise? No, not at all. I, I was just... Relax. <laughs> Officer Chen, I'm not going to ask you to narc on anyone. Yes, ma'am. OK, tell me, how's that new apartment working out? Oh, uh, it's great. It's a quiet neighborhood. There's... Six doses of Narcan. We're in quite a party, huh? Hey, biker's processed. Do we really need all that? Just stay here. You deaf, boo? I said stay in the car. You're not helping her. You're enabling her. This will save her life. Look, at least let me go up. It's going to be OK. But if it isn't. Don't think like that. It's... Look, if it isn't, I'm not going out the way my man Pete here just did. What are you saying? When the time comes, I'm going out on my own terms. Today was day one of stage two of your training. So what? Does that mean I've lost all the respect that I earned? You lost that when you lied on a report. What? I read your account of what happened at the quarantine house. Uh, OK. When I thought I was infected, I told you I'd rather take my life than bleed out. You failed to report it. That's what this is about. You should have detailed everything, regardless of the consequences. Oh, yeah? Like I should have filed a report detailing everything you've done to protect Isabel? You know what? You want to rake me over the coals for the next six months, you go ahead. But don't pretend like it's because you've got some code. Wait a minute. Where are my earrings? I put them in the bag. Sure you did. They were a half carat each. I didn't take your earrings. I didn't take the earrings. I know. This stuff happens sometimes. No, it doesn't. Not to me. God, I've been so focused on us? Did I screw up? Lucy, your boyfriend's here. I mean, if it was Aaron, you would have reported him already. I know, but it's not Aaron. It's you. And you can't be objective when it comes to me, right? Mm -hmm. And thus endeth the Lucy lesson. <laughs> what? <laughs> The earrings were never missing. That's evil. <laughs> and impressive and evil. I know, but you weren't facing the problem. OK, well, now I am. So what do we do? But you deserve to be recognized. You're right. I do. Mm. Look at Bradford. Yeah.